Boomer, what are you complaining about? My finger. What would you do? Dude, come on. This is <laughs> Whoa, Boomer. <laughs> I was just showing you ass. Around. Side, it's healed itself, but on yeah. the inside there's nerve damage. Ew. Did you lose all your compassion whilst traveling? No. Those guys, a bunch of hooligans I'm hanging out with here in the office. So we are going on a little trip to film a master class for worship leader school. I'm gonna give you guys behind the scenes, a little BTS vlog, worship leader school style, and I'll walk you through some of the gear and stuff that we use to make this project possible. Got my 60 Mark II 24 millimeter prime lens, great for photos, also great for YouTube videos. This is what you guys usually see me talking into. Then the GH5, this is actually what I'm shooting this video on right now. It's kind of meta, huh? Uh, I got an audio interface, we're gonna do a uh, podcast as well. And then we've got a uh, shotgun mic right here for the, for the master class, sounds awesome. Come on Alyssa, you're ruining my vlog. No, that's fine. In here, all my cabling, and all my stands, and my clothes for the trip. I'm always so freaking paranoid that I'm gonna forget stuff. Um, but even if I do, um, we just kind of figure it out. You make make do with what you got. We went to Dallas and I didn't pack any underwear, so. You didn't pack underwear, you didn't bring your computer. Nope. All right, show us what you got. Okay. This is a, a behind the scenes of filming work at Leader School Masterclass video. Ready to see this amazing setup in here? Yep. Wow, wow, look at all this space. <laughs> One camera. Okay, so, I, um, I have an extension cable, but I don't know. <laughs> What's that, Ashton? What time is that flight? 3.30? Yeah. Uh -huh. Is that an, uh, a naval effect in Final Cut, or did you download it? All right, so the first thing that I want to get into is we're practically getting into uh, recording a worship album is... What's this, Ashton? Is a master what I class. Would call paralysis by over analysis, right? Sometimes he's what a master class is it? Jake Epsi, how to record a worship album. S B. And produce S B. Did I say Epsi? Yes. <laughs> but this is gonna be dope. Look at that. Oh, Jake looks so great here. The lighting, Look at that the sound jacket, great. bro. So we're gonna show you guys how we make these. All right, we're ready to go, man. You can always look. Look at, look at my name on my bag. Oh, that's so cute. Ooh. Ashton, I'll miss you, man. Hold down the fort. Aye, aye, Captain. And you know, when customers come by, treat them nicely. Help them with what they need. I'm gonna do it just like you told me. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, heck no. Nah. <laughs> we don't have customers come by the office. We're all online. I think what additional work I get done with Ashton, it'll be, it'll be time wasted of distractions, probably. <laughs> I'm not sure who I spend more time waiting on. My wife or Spencer? Spencer and I go back to 2012 when we first arrived at seminary. We are both in the same scholarship group. Dude, that seems like forever ago. Seven years, almost seven years ago. I waited like 10 minutes for him just now, getting through security. He was right behind me. I was just waiting here. I was like ready to go in like two seconds, you know, get the stuff out of the bin, put shoes on get stuff in the bag, and his shoes still aren't tied. What, what were you doing the whole time? Putting those stuff. Apply, <laughs> applying makeup or something? I'm a Bobby girl, in the Bobby world. Oh, yeah. I got grease all over my leather laces, bro. Oh, yeah. 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 made it to Des Moines. What do you think about this place, Spence? So out the window, this whole flight was nothing but white squares. We need to find a warm place to go. I mean, Dallas was okay. Yeah. California was rainy. It was like it cold was rainy. California. Yeah, we've had, the sun's out. I don't know, it looks, winter has got a strong grip on Des Moines still. Yep, depressing place. <laughs> 
Spencer and I are geeked out about Nike because uh, we recently read the book Shoe Dog by Philip Knight, the founder of Nike. Phil Knight. Phil Knight. It's not Philip. No one calls him Philip. It just wouldn't be a true frontier experience if they didn't lose your bags. <laughs> it's like the second time it's happened to me with this airline. Hey, uh, we're outside and yeah, my bag is just not here. So we're gonna have to. My goodness, yeah, we're gonna awful. have to go to a camera store and buy some gear uh, tonight. So. Well, for all I think I might have gear that you could use here at the church. So. Yeah, yeah. Let's talk. See what you got. We can make it work. I mean, we obviously have all the cameras and stuff. It's mainly like tripods and cables and stuff like that. Perfect, bro. I just literally cannot yep. wait to see you. I'm just hurting. Cool. Tony gets well, oh yeah, I see oh, you right I there. Didn't know Spencer was here. There you are. Is this, is this our ride? Is this our lift? Uh, yeah. Hop on in the Tesla, boys. I just can't... I can't fly from here without uh, a really huge test of my patience. Yeah, so my my bag uh, that had all our tripods, my pair of clothes for tomorrow, and cables, like a bunch of mic cables and stuff like that. Who knows where it is? It's just not... It's Yeah, it's like, oh. I want to introduce you guys to David if you haven't met him yet. Hey. He actually has made an appearance on the channel and yeah, podcast, last but while you're driving, looking at this road, you don't have to look at the camera, just tell us what, who you are, what do you do? Hey everybody, little side eye. Uh, my name is David Falsgraf. I uh, own and operate sundaysounds.com. We focus on helping churches uh, sound their best with keys and guitar patches for Mainstage and Ableton. Jeez, Jake, I don't remember how we got connected. I think we just came across each other online and like yeah. worship leading groups and stuff. And, yeah. um, so that's kind of the space we operate in is helping folks uh, make more of what they have or really level up what they do uh, with, uh, you know, as inexpensively as possible. Well, we're going to make a master class for Worship wow. Leader School. So yeah. that I'm very excited about. If you're a student within Worship Leader School, keep an eye out. Uh, this will hopefully publish in, I would say, maybe, like probably April at the latest, maybe sooner. But first, we're going to get lunch. We're going to check out some uh, fine dining here in Jethro's. Iowa. Do we want this fine establishment here? Or do we want this fine establishment it's here? All we don't. Maybe we Jethro's BB BB <laughs> BBQ. Yeah, we got that book right for you. Thanks. What's the word, bro? Good to go. We're good Frank to go. Through. Should Praise I ask him if you guys God. could borrow like clothes or? <laughs> oh, I didn't think about. It. No, we're. I got. <laughs> you know what's funny? This is the third trip in a row that I won't have underwear. <laughs> Spencer's over here worried about clean underwear when I we had bigger issues. I literally so. bought an app to remember to pack everything and then I lost they lost my bag. So I still don't have any of this stuff. <laughs> but good news, David's friend, who actually has all this gear at the church we're gonna film at. We're like, we're all set. Oh man, this is some fine dining in the Midwest, bros. It's all about the quantity here. So we had an amazing barbecue fine dining experience at, uh, what was that place called? Uh, Jethro's Barbecue and Bacon. Wasn't Jethro the father of Moses? I feel like that's in the Bible. Father-in-law. Yeah. Father-in-law Father of Moses. Uh, we're gonna let David go, get back to his family, and we're gonna go uh, sleep. Top of the morning to you. It's great to be an American today. <laughs> you <were> dang right. <laughs> this and this a side of butter. <laughs> <laughs> a side of butter. <laughs> no, this is this is probably illegal in California now. Probably. <laughs> probably. <laughs> This is how we used to go like a month ago. Yeah. David showing off video of himself. Yep. Alright, so we are at, is this Eternity Church? Is that the name of it? Eternity Church. And then, I'm really grateful for these guys, Aaron, right? Yeah. So Aaron is a lifesaver because we're missing so much of our gear, as you guys know from the vlog yesterday. So he hooked us up with a great C-stand, uh, cables. All the, all the things we were missing that were like mission critical for today. So, dude, hey. thank you so much. Try and get your keys player in the mindset of like thinking of, okay, where are we coming from? Where are we now? And where are we going? And then also being super tuned in to what's happening on stage, whether it's 
quiet time where everybody's just reflecting on their own, a time of communion as somebody's praying or giving an altar call, try and teach your keys players to be tuned in to what's happening and what's happening next. How do you like this purple look? So we had a really great day today. We, we filmed the entire master class um, and a couple of YouTube videos and then we recorded a podcast. Whew, I'm exhausted. I got kind of like this headache thing going on. I'm just gonna go ahead, hop on a plane, go back to Denver and give all this footage to Ashton to edit. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll help out a little bit too, but but that, oh, that's another thing. Ashton's back, so he's been helping out a lot, and it really is is, is helping us like take things to the next level um, here at Church Front and Worship Leader School. So with that said, guys, um, I think that's that's a that's a wrap to this vlog. Um, see you next time. I want to make sure I'm locked into that art because it's it's not following me. I'm following it. Oh, good time.